Hello there, my crafty friends. It's Ashley Pfeiffer, the maker behind Stamp Day F. This week's featured product is the new tech support stamp set. Love this. I mean, I'm kind of techy, right? Although with all the issues that I have, you'd never know it. So I just wanted to show you, because it's a standalone stamp set, it can be really easy to miss. It is at the bottom of page 182. You can see here there's a super cute little card with the keys and sorry to hear you have a virus. So I had a good long play with this set. I think I've used everything in here at least once. So this is the card that I'm going to show you. I'm kind of moving it around because I've got quite a bit of texture. I've got the time-worn type embossing folder because the type. And then I have the thanks and hello mini embossing folders. And then I'm also, we'll consider this a Monday mashup, Flowing Flowers. This is in the mini catalog and it is not carrying forward. So if you don't have this in your stash yet, you don't want to miss out. So we are using this sentiment, sending a card instead of a text because, I mean, it's just so cute. And then I've got, I'm thinking of you with a little piece of dog fur. Okay, so I am going to show you this. I will speed things up and do a quick little voiceover and that's all. If this is your first time here, welcome. I hope that you will consider hitting that subscribe button below by the end of the video. Let's get our craft on. I'll show you how I made this. This card comes together quite quickly, but there are a few kind of tedious steps. So first we are going to emboss our two panels, one with a time-worn type and the other with the thanks and hello. The time-worn type is four by five and a quarter and the thanks and hello is three by four and a quarter. I am stamping my little uh, keyboard keys on a scrap of gray granite using gray granite ink. I am going to use, of course, gray granite Stampin' Blends. Uh, first, I'm going to die cut my label here. Stamp the sentiment, sending a card instead of a text using, you guessed it, gray granite ink. I am going to color my buttons, the shadows of the keys, using gray granite. I've got light and then decide it needs just a little bit more, so I come in with the dark for just the front little shadow part. This is a standalone die set, so the keys and anything else in this set do have to be cut out. So this is, of course, the most tedious part. Once these are all cut out, I'm going to apply a mini Stampin' Dimensional to each of the keys and they will go right at the edge of this panel. On my original card, I had the number of letters that would have spelled bonjour, but I kind of felt like it needed to go all the way to the edge, so I've got those two extra letters. You can think of them as two exclamation marks, if you will. So just arrange these at the top and bottom. I'm just going to have three on the bottom and I think it was nine on the top. So I've just got my bow jig here and the gray granite twine from the Baker's Twine Essential Pack. Tying a triple bow, adhere that with a mini glue dot, stamp the sentiment, and it be done. I want to thank you so much for watching this very quick video. If you haven't considered hitting that subscribe button below, I would love for you to do that. You'll catch a new video each and every week, and we'll see you soon, my crafty friends. Bye!